You are officially the last person on the planet that I want to see right now. Well, I can assure you the feeling's mutual. Why don't you do us all a favor and just go straight to hell right now, huh? Why did you have to come round to my house that much? Are you seriously going to blame me right now? I lost everything. You know that, right? My husband, my son, cool. everything. Well, I lost too, Samantha. You haven't cornered that market. And what'd you lose, EJ? I lost Nicole. It's pretty much the only person who ever loved me for who I am. The goal logged out on you? Good. <laughs> come on. You expect me to care? Are you serious? She's gonna come back to you? She has no self-respect, stupid cow. And can't compare you losing the Nicole and me losing my husband and my son. <sighs> Are you quite serious? Of course I am. <laughs> God, Samantha, you are a... Selfish little bitch. Don't you dare minimize what I had with Nicole. What we had was real. Oh, yeah, a real joke. <laughs> right. Yeah. Compared to you and your marriage, maybe. Shut up. My pain is no less than yours, Samantha. Are you serious? Serious, you want to compare? You lost your publicist. I lost my husband. <sighs> You are pathetic. Do you know that? The only person you ever think about is yourself. Well, if that's true, it's because I'm the only person I can count on. Oh, I see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Poor old Samantha Brady, always the victim. I think it's about time that you face the truth, my dear. <sighs> you have some karma coming to you, sweetheart. And it's going to destroy you. I'm really nice attitude, Mayor Demara. Talking about the mother of your children like that, and wanting her to be destroyed? Smell, it is because of our children that I have looked past many of your faults. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have any compassion for them anymore. You are selfish and you are toxic. And frankly, I think that my children could do a lot better. Go to hell. You brought this upon yourself, Samantha. Getting exactly what you deserve. You deserve everything that's coming to you. You just want to see me lose everything, don't you? I think you're long overdue for some punishment, Samantha. And watching your husband and your son walk out of the house. You don't talk about them. Don't mention their names. You can sign yourself to this and I like, shot my head and left me for dead. Well, I wish I'd killed you, because then none of this would have happened. It's highly doubtful, my dear. You would have found another way to push them out of the house. You see, you're destined to live your life alone. God, I hate you. I really, really, really hate you, DJ. <laughs>